Well, hey there guys, welcome to Rock Hard Riffs. In today's video, we're going to discuss whether I have a favorite pedal or not, or maybe one or two or three. I don't know, let's check it out. Rock Hard Riffs, the rock and roll guitar jam. That's right guys, this is Rock Hard Riffs, the rock and roll guitar channel for the self-taught. Hey, if you happen to be new to our channel, please take a look through our playlist. Just take a gander there, and uh, if you like what you see, please subscribe. We'd really appreciate that, and make sure you spread the word. Okay, guys, so the question is, do I have a favorite pedal? I'm going to say, yeah, yeah, I do. It's the Digitech Trio Band Creator Plus Looper. There's just nothing cooler than what this thing does. Let's listen to it. Not only is it a looper, not only does it have a drum machine that reads what you're playing and also a bass player along with that, I mean, isn't that cool enough as it is? It also has a guitar effects button where which each genre or style it changes. You can sequence all this stuff. Again, you can have a different style. So we're listening to rock. We're going to change that over to jazz. Let's check that out. Let's change the tempo. Let's turn up the bass. I like more bass. How about you? Change the bass. Eh, let's change it again. I think you get the idea. Now, this right here, where this would normally be plugged in. That sends the drum and the bass as like a completely separate signal from the guitar output. So this is the bass and drum output, this is the guitar output. If I unplug that, like you see that, everything goes through the guitar output. What didn't they think of on this thing? I mean, it is just so incredibly cool. Do I have another favorite pedal? <laughs> That'd be the Strymon Sunset. This thing is so flexible. I mean, there are other switches and stuff to, up at the top, which affects brightness and also combining both sides. So you have like a Texas Overdrive on the left side and also their Germanium and a treble boost. On the right side, we have the two-stage drive. We have the hard clipping drive and a JFET boost. And you can combine these one way or another. You can EQ them however you like. This is just an awesome pedal too. And the switches are easy to operate. You can use a foot switch on it if you want to operate it that way. But really what makes this pedal so great, in my opinion, are just the sounds of the drives in it. They're fantastic. Let's go ahead and isolate one of those tracks we were listening to. You can hear the guitar. <laughs> Now hopefully that sounds as good on the camera as it does coming out of my amp that's going again through the Orange Cross 35RT. That was a mixture of both the Germanium drive on one guitar, there were two guitars in there, and also the Texas Overdrive. And what a cool combination. Let's hear that again. <laughs> Now let's hear it in the mix again. Let's go back to rock. That's an original song, by the way. That's called Get Up. 
Uh, I'll link that in the top comments. It's an original song. Cool video to it, I think. Might want to check that out. You might enjoy it, guys. So anyway, those are my top two. If I had a third one, it would be the Dig, the Strymon Dig. That's the dual digital delay. Does all kinds, again, cool stuff. Strymon makes just really great pedals. And uh, I got great deals on all of these pedals, and that's why I have them. But just fantastic stuff. You know, the dual delay is awesome, and I can also combine it with the Boss pedal. Digital delay, too, and you get even more cool stuff. I love so all the pedals books. that I have, you know, I use them all almost all equally but i really use that strymon sunset and the delay too most often and in many different configurations on the uh, sunset i just love that thing and of course the digitech trio band creator plus looper in my opinion is probably one of the absolute coolest things ever invented i sure wish they had them when i was younger but i'm sure glad that i'm able to mess with it now too as well all right, guys, let us know what you think. Please uh, leave a comment. We really appreciate that, and let us know what you're thinking. All right, guys, this is Rock Hard Griffs, the rock and roll guitar channel for the self-taught. Don't forget to subscribe, and we'll see you next video.